From here, we'll go into our client dashboard. If I were to pick one screen in Advisom that really differentiates us from any other system out there, it would be this. This is a screen that combines both things that would live typically within a CRM system, a standalone, and a reporting system into a single dashboard. So recent history, all notes, activities, emails, anything to or from anyone in the household, all going to be visible here, feed style. That is right next to what would traditionally live within a reporting system for our portfolio asset allocation, historical returns, et cetera. Integrations I'll hit on real quick here because they're front and center. What we try to do with integrations is make them great. So we would like to do images. We'd like to do single sign-on. Importantly, we want to make these contextual as well. And what that means is if I click this risk score right here or this Money Guide Pro icon, that's going to bring me over to this client record right within those respective systems. If I create a note from this screen here, some cool capability we built just earlier this year is template. So if you want to track a client meeting, you can start with what you want everyone to pull out of that meeting and document here. That also applies to activities as well as workflows. Client profile. This is where our householding is created. We have various settings available to us, custom fields. Contracts and dates are all tracked here. When did you last deliver your ADV, for example? Document management is built right in to this client dashboard. If you're picking up on a theme here, everything is built around advisor workflow rather than capability set. So a little bit different than what you see in a fragmented tech stack. Custodial integrations have also been a focal point for us. So as an example with Schwab, monthly statements and tax forms. We have that capability with a number of different custodians. We go here into our client portal. So one of the things I mentioned was, was our growth suite. So that starts with our fact finder. It's gonna be applied to both clients and prospects. This is built around data collection. So collecting all this information digitally, new prospects, this will create a prospect record within the advise on system so all information can be captured and retained when they move over to being a client if we go back to our templates here we have a prospect specific template so nothing like your account history performance history etc on this particular screen it's going to flow into our opportunity tracking app so we have these they're called kanban boards available to look at what you have in each stage of your pipeline. Again, this is going to apply to both clients and prospects. Once you get the go ahead to move forward, you have the workflow automation that I highlighted earlier, but also digital account opening tools with a number of different custodians. So we've captured all the information within AdviseOn. We've engaged with our prospect once it's time to get those accounts open that can be done digitally right through our system as well.